Hey everyone, I wanted to make a video on um, how to trip an anchor. Um, I've got a couple ideas I'm going to try out. Um, I've got a 23 foot center console uh, fishing boat, sportsman. Um, love the boat. Uh, we've lost an anchor recently though. Um, got on a, a spot, dropped anchor, and it ended up catching the reef. Um, I had to cut the rope. I was unable to get the, the anchor loose. But what I've got now is um, a way that that doesn't happen. I looked online, YouTube videos, whatever, and I found that on uh, some of these anchors, um, this is a size 13. Uh, I know that my boat is a 23 foot but this one's rated for 25 to 30 foot which it normally is better to uh, go up an anchor um, and in my situation uh, it's just borderline uh, the the other anchor is just not that uh, the one under this it, it wouldn't hold my boat in the currents that we have so what I ended up doing was a lot of videos showed that you put a shackle or something, drill a hole here, attached your chain here, ran it down here, and then put a tie right here. Well, I felt like if I did that, that that would end up um, uh, only being able to use it one way or the other, you know, th it, this is made to, to go both ways. So when you drop it, that it does. Um, so when I drop this one, it will go in that way. Now, if I drop it this way, it will go in that way. Um, I think the other way, you would be limited to it only working one side. So what I did is I took a, a chain, and my original idea was to have this chain to where it would just slide over your stabilizer bar. And then I was going to shackle it in the back. Um slide those two on make it tight shackle it right there uh, but my chain ended up being too small to go over the stabilizer so what i ended up doing was putting these uh, shackles on it right here and then looping the shackles on which i think is going to work just as fine um, and then you take it and you pull it up um, zip tie it here uh, i i wanted to use a 70 pound um, zip tie um, I think this one's only like a 20 pounds of tie, um, but it's it's been carrying the weight of the anchor and everything so far. So it may be enough, it may not. But and then um, the two anchor, the two chains come together here, shackled, and I've got 16 foot of chain uh, going this way. And then I'll put my rope on that end. But now the idea is is that. Once it's pulled, it'll dig into the dirt or sand. I'm in the sand bottom. If it gets hung up, then I'll be able to pull it this way. And once it snatch, once I snatch it this way, it'll break that and it'll be hooked here and it'll just pull straight up out of the out of whatever wreck it's on. So um, that's what I'm trying to do at this point and. Once I get it in the water and test it out, I'll put another vi uh, video together and show you all what happens. Thank you.